here is tonight's tale of the day. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight is three rounds in the UFC bantamweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner, Mejie Jackson! And now introducing our opponent, fighting out of the red corner, Myra Chitara! You ready? You ready? Let's do it. Good to have you with us tonight from T-Mobile Arena, the home of the NHL's Vegas Golden Knights, and the building in which DC shocked some of the MMA world at UFC 226, but this venue will always have a special place. This venue holds a special place in my heart. UFC 226, I became the double champion. This is a fight venue that you should want to compete in. A great arena where you can make history. Tonight, you get your chance. Well, we told you off the top, she's got the longer reach and certainly made good use of it in landing that straight punch there. Chasson gets caught by that straight hand. Another punch to the head. It won't take many of those. Oh, solid kick right there. Big shots being landed on both sides here. very bad. She's on skates. She has to get moving. If she stays in front of her opponent, she's going to take one more that's going to end the night. Look for her to throw that overhand here again. Strong outside leg kick. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Oh, big left hook there. The takedown is not there. Nice. Nicely done. All right, look for her to go back to that overhand here again. Seemingly when she has gone to it tonight, it has been there. Let's see if she goes back to it again now. Takedown defense holds up. Trying to establish that jab once again. Seven and blow of this fight thus far. Yeah, man, she landed a massive hook, and it has her opponent in the Feels like the beginning of the end. Oh, she hurt her bed. All right, so watch for her to set up that hook here again. We were in our fighter meeting on Thursday. She said the fans are starting to call her Madam Lineker. She sees it as. This is big. That's big. Now we're going. All right, well, she's landed those hooks at a high clip. Oh, 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 huge left. Oh, stuffs the takedown without issue. And now some separation between the two athletes. Oh. Horn set for the end of round oh, one. Stop. All right, there's the horn signifying the end of the round, and what a round it was for her. We talked about her power off the top of the show, and she certainly put it on full display there. Power is what identifies her. She got her hands going, was able to land a big shot, got the knockdown, didn't get the finish, but if she's patient, sets everything up again, maybe she'll find the finish in this round. All right, so there it is, the end of the round. Somehow she survives and advances after getting knocked down with a big punch there in that round. She's tough. She's durable. But she cannot continue to take strikes like this. She needs to move her head on the center line. She cannot be a stationary target if she has any desire to win this fight. You ready to fight? Ready. Round two here. Nice jab by Maida Bueno Silva. Able to check the high kick. Nice job by her with the kick there. Straight right hand. 
but she misses. Well, not just a high output fight to this point, but a high accuracy fight as well. Both fighters have absorbed a lot of damage thus far. These two women. Oh, huge connection fire there. Massive shot, man. How she's gonna try to find the next shot that'll finish the fight. Plenty of time to go here, round two. Well, she has certainly picked up the pace here in round two and starting to find herself in the pocket a little bit. She was a little bit hesitant in round one. No hesitancy whatsoever here in round two. She has clearly found her rhythm and range. Well, pretty good recovery by her opponent after being stunned, but we see this all the time, right? If you don't close the deal when you have that on Got it, and now she's gonna see if she can close the night. There's that left hand. <laughs> well, she continues to bide her time here on the feet. Now throws a front kick and lands. That front kick was beautiful. Bueno Silva's nose is bleeding now. It looks to be cut perhaps there on the bridge. Oh! All right, so she gets the flush knockout here tonight, and you gotta think this is gonna lead to a lot of big fights the rest of the way this year. Big opportunities are presented after you have a performance like this. She did an amazing job and got a massive knockout victory. We set it inside the octagon for the official decision. Here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean's called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 29 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Macy Jackson! Well, you see the raw emotions and the happiness out of her and her corner. What a result here tonight as she gets it done by knockout. I mean, she could not have imagined that it would go this well. I know she said it would happen.